Have you got a clay soil or a sandy soil? Well, the good news is that organic matter can help both. So listen up. In my garden, I'm tackling clay. And that means that new plants can have a hard time trying to get established because the clay soil compacts really easily, making it harder for the plant roots to get down into the ground. So we can open that up with a bit of organic matter. Now this top layer doesn't look too bad, but this only lasts for about five to 10 centimetres before we're gonna hit really hard clay. So let's get this out and have a look. And there we go. In no time at all, I'm down to this hard, sticky clay. Now this stuff's not too bad at holding onto water and onto nutrients, but new plants can struggle to get their roots down into it. So we can improve the planting hole with organic matter in the form of compost. This is a certified organic compost mix that will help break up the clay soil and aerate it, adding valuable humus to the soil for better plant health. Now, to add some more organic matter and essential nutrients, I'm going to use the 5-in-1 fertiliser. This organic fertiliser is brilliant because it's loaded with all the essentials. 5-in-1 is also certified organic and it contains cow, fowl and sheep manures, mushroom compost, zeolite, blood and bone plus added trace elements and minerals. Just mix it through the existing soil to give your plants that little bit of extra oomph. Right now, this hole is prepped and ready for planting. Now, of course, if you had a sandy soil, these two products in combination will still help to improve it. They add organic matter to the soil, which will help hold moisture and nutrients right where it's needed. An essential step to soil prep in my garden is using the premium compost mix and the five in one together. I love that they're safe to use on all the plants in my garden and they really do give things a great kickstart. This 30 litre bag of five in one is the dig in mix, but it also comes in a liquid or pellet form, which are great for applying to existing plants. And in the veggie garden, compost is king. Mix through some every time you plant. This added organic matter really helps the soil retain moisture and nutrients for healthier veggies. When I'm adding these to an organic veggie garden, I love to turn them through the soil about 10, 20 centimetres deep. You don't need to go any deeper. So no matter what type of soil you've got, with these tips, you can have your soil prepped and ready for planting and your plants will thrive. Mm -hmm.